your holiness it is an honor to have you here with us today at sampurnanan sanskrit university in varanasi you are known as a spiritual leader worldwide and your presence here in the spiritual capital of india adds great significance can you share your thoughts on being welcomed by the eminent classical singer anuradha padwal with such devotion and enthusiasm varanasi holds a special place in the hearts of many not just in india but globally as the city resonates with spirituality and wisdom anuradha ji's welcoming gesture is truly heartwarming and reflects the deep rooted spiritual essence of this sacred city absolutely varanasi indeed has a unique aura that touches everyone who visits moving forward could you shed some light on the significance of institutions like sampurnanand sanskrit university in preserving and promoting our ancient wisdom and knowledge systems institutions like sampurnanand sanskrit university play a crucial role in preserving a rich heritage and culture they serve as pillars in promoting the timeless wisdom enshrined in sanskrit literature and scriptures through education and research these institutions ensure that the treasures of our past continue to illuminate the path for generations to come your words does resonate deeply emphasizing the importance of preserving our cultural heritage speaking of heritage you have been instrumental in spreading the message of peace and harmony worldwide how do you envision the role of spirituality in fostering global unity and understanding spirituality transcends boundaries and unites humanity under the umbrella of love and compassion regardless of race religion or nationality the essence of spirituality lies in recognizing the inherent divinity within each individual by nurturing this universal outlook we can bridge differences and cultivate a world where peace and harmony prevail your vision for a peaceful world is truly inspiring as we conclude what message would you like to share with the youth of today especially those aspiring to contribute positively to society to the youth i would say embrace your potential with confidence and compassion each of you possesses unique talents and abilities that can catalyze positive change in the world cultivate inner resilience through practices like meditation and self reflection and let your actions be guided by values of integrity and service remember the future lies in your hands and together we can create a world brimming with hope and possibility your holiness thank you for gracing us with your wisdom and presence today your insights have been invaluable and we are truly grateful for the opportunity to learn from you it has been my pleasure my peace and prosperity prevail in every corner of the world thank you take care